we're here today, we're talking about slings a little bit. And I just kind of wanted to discuss the, uh, the use of a sling. I know I spoke about what types of slings there are. And today I'm just going to demonstrate the two-point sling. So this, this kind of configuration here, like across the body, is uh, more like a patrolling technique. If you were just walking out in um, any area and you're just trying to hold your rifle, but kind of at the ready, that way you can shoulder it if need be, this isn't a bad position for that. However, if you're about to enter a room, you're about to clear a house, we're going to go with a necklace position. So the necklace position is just like it sounds. It's just hanging down on your neck. You're walking through a house. You're going to have your gun either up and high ready. You're going to have it down. Whatever, you, However you clear the house, that's how you're going to have the gun. Uh, and the reason that you, you don't want your arm in there is because when you're going around corners left and right, you're transitioning to your right and left eye. You can't really do that inside of a sling, uh, at least not like this. So that's why you want to be in that necklace position when you're clearing a house. Another good thing about this too is if, for instance, you're in the necklace position and you engage someone and now you have to put your rifle behind your back to go hands on or whatever the case, you can just take the gun and literally just put it behind your back. Now it's completely out of the way and you can administer aid or you can uh, handcuff somebody. Or The point is, is that this is the preferred way to enter a house is the method uh, for the necklace.